You're not running out on me, are you? Sorry, no, I was <laughs> just... No, it's fine. It uh, happens all the time. Well, it looks like someone's keeping the tooth very busy. Oh, you can say that, yeah. <laughs> Shall we? Uh, sure. Listen, Mary, <clears throat> I know coming to the dentist has got to be frightening. But I assure you, we're not monsters. Speak for yourself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sue, this is Mary. Mary, Sue. Hi. <laughs> you know, yeah. I just don't understand why I have to have my teeth pulled. They, they feel perfectly fine. Sure. They feel fine now, but those wisdom teeth tend to want to shift around over time. And before you know it, you've got a, a mouthful of trouble. <laughs> you know, dentistry has come a long way since the days that your parents had their teeth yanked out in the back of a barn. Oh, my, my parents did. Recent advancements in modern dentistry have rendered the process practically painless. Up there. Just a few tugs of this and you'll hardly remember we had this conversation. It's like treating yourself to a nice bottle of wine. <laughs> or 10. <laughs> <laughs> so, Mary. <clears throat> what do you say? Deep breaths. Feeling a little woozy? Yeah. yeah. It's a little. Sorry about that. Open. Num num time. Okay, wide now. Wow. Good. Prick. And upper. There it is. Oh my. You have beautiful teeth. Has anyone told you that? They're almost sumptuous. Sue, you gotta see this. Wide, wide now. Open, oh, there you are. So how much do you give per tooth? Mm. Some give a dime, others, you know, most a nickel. One lady uh, gave a quarter per tooth. <laughs> what an old kook. Uh, I, I... Oh, what was that? Uh, ten, ten cents. I, I give ten cents. That a girl. Okay. Very still now. Okay. Did we ever tell you the original story of the uh, <clears throat> Tooth Fairy? Uh -uh. No? Uh -uh. Creepy stuff. <laughs> and all done. We'll just give that a moment to set in. So originally, the tooth fairies were a sight different than the winged women we often think of today. Winged. Is winged a word? Originally, they were called the bone groove. A mighty race of uh, creatures that lived beneath the earth and fed on the bones and teeth of the dead. They, they had bones? And teeth. See, uh, the child would lose a tooth and their 
uh, parents would bury it in the ground, and the Gru would sense it, and they would be appeased. God. Anyway, eventually, the humans evolved and moved into the city. <laughs> and they no longer had ground to bury their teeth in. So they used pillows instead. <laughs> the children were happy and they grew, were appeased. Seems like an awful lot of trouble to go through for some, some measly teeth. It adds up. Nurse will have instruction on your way out. Call us if you have too much pain. Oh, and uh, let's see that kid of yours. Uh, sooner rather than later. <laughs> 